Our data indicates that July 2023 was the warmest July on record for the globe. And it was the warmest July by a long shot, specifically by more than a third of a degree Fahrenheit. That may not sound like a lot, but the margin for most global records is on the order of a hundredth of a degree or two. So last month was way, way warmer than anything we've ever seen. The warmest month of the year for global temperatures is also typically in July, just like it's usually the warmest month of the year for most places in the United States. Given that July 2023 was the warmest July on record and July is the globe's warmest month of the year, it's very likely that July 2023 was hottest, hotter than any month in any year since at least 1850. Having said that, the really important thing to remember is that July 2023 is just the latest in a long run of extremely warm months and years going back several decades. In other words, the long-term increase in global temperature marches on and on and on. We have now seen 47 consecutive Julys that are above the 20th century average and 533 consecutive months above the 20th century average. It's also worth thinking about El Nino and its impact on things going forward, as Gavin mentioned. El Nino tends to increase global temperatures, albeit with a several month lag, meaning it probably did not have much of an impact on this July record. Given NOAA's forecast right now, there is over a 95% chance that El Nino will continue through the winter. We could see even bigger impacts in the winter and spring as El Nino peaks. While El Nino might not have had much impact on air temperatures, it did contribute to the record-breaking global ocean temperatures. For the fourth consecutive month, the global ocean surface temperatures hit a record high as El Nino conditions that emerged in June continued into July. Over 40% of the ocean is currently experiencing marine heat wave, with our predictions showing that that could continue into the fall or even expand. Meanwhile, in the far south, Antarctic sea ice coverage ranked the lowest on record for the third consecutive month, contributing to the July 2023, setting a record for the lowest global July sea ice extent on record. Putting all of this together, 2023 to date has been the third warmest on record. According to NCEI's Global Annual Temperature Outlook and data through July, it is virtually certain, over 99% chance, that 2023 will rank among the five warmest years on record, with a nearly 50% probability that 2023 will rank warmest on record. El Ninos can temporarily warm the globe by approximately 0.1 degrees Celsius, an equivalent to the expected warming over a 10-year time horizon. A year like this gives us a glimpse into how rising temperatures and heavier rains can impact our society and stress critical infrastructure over the next decade. It's important to remember that these years will be cool by comparison by the middle of the century if we continue to warm our planet as greenhouse gas emissions continue. Put another way, the next few years will be the coolest for the rest of my life if the world continues to emit greenhouse gases into the atmosphere. Thank you.